Hey everyone, today's lesson is a little bit different than usual. It's not really a lesson. Uh, someone by the YouTube name of Squeezebox Corner sent me a challenge and they sent me four chords, um, B over G major, B flat over G minor, A minor to a D7, four chords. And they said I could improvise as much as I want with my right hand, just the left hand chords have to be B, so I'm assuming the left hand chords have to be G, G minor, A minor, D7. Uh, I haven't played them yet, I just wrote them down and turned on the video. So let's, let's see what we can do with them. It's a little bit confusing because B over G... I don't know if that's what the, the user meant, but, but let's go with a G major, G minor, A minor, D7. I'm just doing the chords. So that's B over G, I'm assuming is a, let's do it as a G major seven, right? Because it's a B over G. And then B flat over G minor. And then an A minor. And then a D seven. So I'm just gonna improvise over it and let's see what, what we come up with. I might just play it through a few times just to get uh, some, some ideas of what notes sound good on it.
It's a beautiful, uh, it's, it, they're interesting chords, right? Um, that's improvising over it. Squeezebox Corner, let me know if that, those are the chords that you had in mind. Um, it's a nice chord progression, right? Typically we have, a, let's say, a G major. Or a G major 7. To the minor 2, to the A minor. Resolves to the D7. Back to the 1. The, the wrench that's thrown in there um, is it goes from the G major to the minor, then to the A minor. So lots of variations. I'm not a composer, so every time I do something, it changes. There was a little bit of a melodic theme there. The right and then and then the turnaround the minor two to the five uh yeah let me know if any of you have some chords that you're thinking of and you're trying to come up with a melody send me the chords and I, i'm happy to do these videos again thank you